This release has some exciting new features and enhancements just in time for the snow season, and they're great for landscaping as well. First, let's look at how easy it is to bulk move work tickets on the schedule board. Simply hold your control key and select the work tickets you need to move. You can even select tickets across multiple weeks. If you need to deselect a work ticket, continue holding the control key and click the item to deselect. With multiple tickets selected, click Bulk Move at the top. Choose the route and date and all selected tickets will be moved. And one quick note, you can also move multiple tickets from the month view. However, you can't move the tickets to a different route, only a different date. Next, you can bulk deactivate routes. From the Manage Routes page, Simply select the routes you need to deactivate. And from the Bulk Actions menu, select Deactivate. Likewise, you can bulk reactivate routes if needed. The next feature allows you to show or hide the Create New Ticket button in Crew Mobile. For example, you may want to hide this button for snow subcontractors so they can't create new tickets. You'll see this setting in a Routes Details page at the top right. Next, we've got a couple of great enhancements for invoicing. You can quickly generate per-service invoices for individual work tickets. This makes it easy to bill for one or multiple services simultaneously. When viewing per-service invoice types, you'll see each work ticket listed as a separate invoice. The selected work tickets will show as separate services on the invoice. Next, in Admin, Configuration, Invoicing, you can check to use the Opportunity Item Display Name on invoices. That means if a service name is changed on an estimate, it will display as such on any corresponding invoices. Next, contacts that are not associated with a record can be deleted. In admin, there's a role permission to enable delete contacts. This feature is most helpful when a contact is created by mistake and has not been added to a property, for example. It's laying the groundwork for merging duplicate contacts coming in a future release. The next feature prevents your organization from creating duplicate property records. When you save a new property, Aspire will compare the address to other property records to let you know if there are any potential duplicate records, including inactive records. You can quickly review the records and decide whether or not to create the new property. Next, working with attachments is better than ever. Before attaching an item to a property or opportunity record, you can now see a preview. And from the preview window, you can attach or download the item. From within an opportunity, you can select existing attachments to send with proposals or upload new attachments when generating a proposal email. Lastly, changing per service and TNM as needed services is easier than ever. From an opportunity, simply initiate a change order. Then select Change from the menu next to the service. And even if no as-needed work tickets have been created yet, a new item will be added. If an open or scheduled work ticket exists for the item, you'll be prompted to select which work ticket should be updated. As you can see, this release is full of new enhancements that help you efficiently manage your snow and landscaping business. 
If you have any questions, we're always here to help. Thanks for using Aspire.